everybody, welcome back to another fantastic episode of Ready to Die Fighting. Uh, we've been doing some cool things with food and learning a lot of different fermenting, dehydrating, canning, all that type of stuff. And by far my favorite thing to make, and the thing that we actually enjoy consuming the most, has been kombucha and ginger beer. And this is especially exciting because this ginger beer is flavored with strawberries and basil. And where did those strawberries and basil come from? Right over there. There's right from our dirt and we got some strawberries and some basil. So that's one of the really cool things is we've been able to flavor some of these things from the fruits from the garden. Now this is very carbonated. That's why I'm outside about to open it. Um, I started to open it and, whew, whew, but I think it's gonna be good. I just, I just didn't want it to spray all over the house like the last time somebody did. Ooh, look at it go, boom. You don't have to get that close, I don't think. <laughs> like it's like just pushing all the strawberries and basil. Just go, it'll do it. I, well, when it sprays out, that wastes it. <laughs> I'm, I don't know which one I like more, ginger beer or kombucha. They're both delicious, a little bit different. Um, I've never tried this particular flavor before. My next flavor that I'm excited about making, I haven't made it yet, um, but it's the next planned batch, is um, gonna be some cucumber lime. I think that'll be good. Let's just go for it. All right, that wasn't too bad. And where's the glass? Let's. can't even get out. There we go. It's a nice color. Nice pink. It smells good. Let's give it a tasty taste. This one... Honestly, I don't know that I taste basil. It's good. It's good, but I don't know that I taste the basil. It's a nice color though, isn't that? Isn't that pretty? Ginger beer I think is just so pretty. Tasty. One of these days I'll do a video on how to make some of this stuff, but you can definitely find some recipes online. Um, I will actually link to the YouTube video that I used to learn how to make it. I don't know, that, he made a really great video, I forgot his name, I think it's Jonathan something, but he made a really good video on how to make ginger beer. I followed his recipe, it came out great, and I've been making it for a couple months now, and we, just all summer long, we've been drinking ginger beer. There's a lot of health benefits to it, supposedly. I don't care about that. It just tastes good. <laughs> That's it for this one. Like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. If you would like to see how I make um, ginger beer and kombucha, and maybe I can talk about some of the health benefits and stuff. Not as important in my opinion. That's not why I drink it. I just drink it because I like it, and it's fun to make. Um, and it's just such a nice, refreshing beverage. Can you keep the camera on me? <gasps> this kid. Never hire a kid to be your cameraman, <laughs> I tell you. <ya. laughs> I'll see you guys in the next